Hey guys, if you're in the market for a serial ATA solid state drive, really the only thing you should be looking at is the Samsung drives. And there are other brands that are quality, but just speaking from experience, the Samsung SSDs are very fast. And quite frankly, with, with a serial ATA drive, they're all pretty much the same speed. But with Samsung, you're gonna get their, their quality and their um, reliability. And that's the important thing to me is reliability because when you're putting in, when you're putting data on a drive, usually it's because it's important to you, right? I mean, yes, there's some kind of um, sometimes you're just writing some data that's going to get deleted, but if you don't want your data to disappear on you and you really want to um, protect your data, go with a reputable quality solid state drive. And if your computer doesn't support NVMe, like a PCI Express card, um, and you have to go serial ATA. These are two of your best options here. And I'm not gonna go into detail about which is better. I'm just gonna unbox the two so you can kind of see the differences in just look and what you're getting. So there's really, again, I'm not going into any specific details. So we have on the left, the 860 Evo, which is a 500 gigabyte drive, solid state drive, and the Pro, which is 512 gigabytes. So the first one I'll unbox is the 860 Evo. Let's look at the box itself. The SSD that makes the difference boosts your PC performance with the reliable SSD. And they do put on the back that it is a reliable SSD. And you, for, for most companies, I mean, every company would say that, of course. Who's gonna say their SSD is not reliable? With Samsung, it really is reliable. They're, they're, they're great drives. Uh, so this has the VNAN technology. Uh, comes with a five-year warranty, which is nice. You don't always get that from uh, lesser brands. Uh, you might save a little bit money up front, but when your drive goes bad um, and you, your one-year warranty or whatever doesn't uh, help you out, you know you'll be you'll be wishing that you spent more money in a more reputable brand. And, and again, Samsung's not the only wonderful brand. There are other brands out there that are that are great, but this is the top of the line, in my opinion, from my experience. So let's go ahead and open up the box. So it, there's tape on the top. Pull out my knife here. There's some tape here. Try not to destroy the box. There we go. And inside, you'll be surprised, it's very sparse or sparse, if that's the word. Uh, let's see. There's very little there. So we have the, the drive itself, and then we have a manual. And for whatever reason, Samsung has put a piece of tape to keep it shut. I don't know why that's really necessary, but we'll cut that tape. And you get this little installation guide. Uh, a lot of different languages here. That is probably, that's Chinese because you see samsung.com slash cn. Uh, the Magician software is good software. All different languages of how to download the Magician software. The Magician software is good for uh, formatting the drive, upgrading the firmware on the drive. Um, and you can actually get a speed boost uh, using the Magician software as well. So this is the Evo, this is 500 gigabytes. And again, it's a very simple drive. You see the screws there, the screw holes for mounting. You also have those on the bottom. We have power and data and the screw holes there. And if you'll notice, um, the square here is like a silver color, a grayish silver. And that's basically indicating that it's an Evo drive. So let's take a look now at the Pro. Whoa, you get a whole additional 12 gigabytes, so 512 gigabytes. Uh, also uses the VNAN technology on the back. So it's, so it's funny, what do I do with the other box here? So we have two uh, statements here. So um, boost your PC performance, the reliable SSD, that's the Evo. So it's kind of saying, hey, if you don't have an SSD yet, um, here's a great reliable SSD you can use for an upgrade. With the Pro, it's saying professional performance, ultimate endurance. So it's saying this is our this is our top drive. This is for uh, you know professional um, performance. It's not necessarily an upgrade drive. This is probably meant for someone who's already has an SSD. They're looking to upgrade. Uh, most, you know, it could, but of course it could be for for people that are still running um, a 2.5 inch um, you know or 3.5 inch uh, hard drive in there desktop or uh, computer or 2.5 inch in their, in their laptop that wants to upgrade, they could go with this Pro as well. But I, I think the Evo is more designed for people that are upgrading 
um, from that just haven't gotten around to upgrading yet. This is more of like a professional draw for people that have probably already been using SSDs for a little while, if that makes any sense. So I'm gonna cut the tape here too. And I expect the insides to be pretty much identical to the Evo. Again, we have this booklet that's taped shut. And I guess the tape is just to keep, let's see here, that other booklet in to keep this piece from falling out. We don't want that in there. But again, you definitely want to download the Samsung Magician software. Um, great option for your um, SSD. Okay. So here we see, again, it looks identical, right? So the two drives, they're almost identical. They say Samsung solid state drive, they're almost identical. But what shows that it's the Pro Drive is now this uh, orangey reddish. It looks mm, maroonish. It depends. It's a kind of a cool color. It's like a red, maroon, orange color. Nine, six, the, I'm sorry, the 860 Pro. We have the same mounting screws. Same serial ATA uh, data and power port. So, you know, this is not going to give you the best speed, even though this is a pro drive it's a pro drive that's also serial ata so if you want to get like the maximum performance you're going to want to go with the pci express uh you know nvme ssd if you don't have that you know let's say a desktop computer if you do have pci express um you know 2.0 or 3.0 on your desktop computer you could add a, a card to add nvme uh you know to add an nvme card uh, you know uh, ssd in there but if you don't want to go that route, you could get something like this, hook it up to your standard serial ATA cables, um, also good for a laptop upgrade. Uh, if you have a 2.5 inch mechanical hard drive, um, either one of these drives will give you um, great performance. I think most home users will be absolutely fine with the Evo. And I think even professional users, the the Pro, I don't know, it's, it's funny, I don't know that people are gonna see a huge difference I mean, they both come, they both come with a a five year warranty, right? Five year limited warranty. Um, they're both going to give you about the same speed, right? So, so serial ATA drives are already like saturating serial ATA. You're really not going to get much faster. Um, so, they're both pretty much the same speed. The big difference here about the professionals, you're getting the 512 gigabytes. Um, but I mean, if 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 you're looking for the best of the best, uh, the, the Pro will, will do it for you. But if you're just upgrading from a mechanical hard drive, and this is going to be like your first SSD, go with the Evo. You know, save save some cash. Um, if money is no object, go with the Pro. Um, but really, I mean, they're both pretty much using the same technology. They're both serial ATA. Um, you know, the Pro gives you a little bit more capacity, as you can see there, but not much, right? So... You do the math, folks. You figure out what you need. You know, if you're, um, you know, if you're looking to save some dough, go with the Evo. If money is no object, you just want the. And, I mean, and again, if, if money is no object and you're building a PC, you probably have an NVMe um, drive, right? Because that's going to give you the best performance. Um, so it, it's like if money is no object and you also, you know, can't use a PCI Express drive for whatever reason, and you have to use serial AT, maybe in a lap, maybe you have a laptop. It's a really nice laptop, um, you know, and, you know, you want to add an SSD to it. Again, it probably already has an SSD, but you just want to upgrade the capacity. Um, that, but that's your decision to make, folks, of which you should go with the Pro or the Evo. I think the Evo is probably the better value for most people, um, but that's for you to decide. So if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. I'm more than happy to answer anything about these drives. I just wanted to do a quick comparison as far as the unboxing uh, nothing to do with performance. I will test the performance as well on both of these, um, but this is strictly the unboxing to see what the difference is uh, between the drives uh, for packaging and for what's inside the box. As you can see, it's pretty much the same thing. All right, folks. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.